Hello, everybody, and welcome. This is Adrian. Thank you so much for joining me today. Let's play some more Hearts of Iron 4 in our German campaign. We've just gone to war. We are going to invade Poland. We don't have the Molotov Ribbentrop Pact, which is interesting. So let's at least um, get ready for this war, right? So I have Italy, Bulgaria, and Hungary in my in my nation or in my in my uh, faction. Um, let's see here. I can set a national focus. I can't do the anti-Soviet pact yet. I could do Molotov Ribbentrop pact. That'd be cool. Or I could do something else. I could befriend Sweden. Hmm. Demand Slovenia. Actually, that would be something to do, huh? Yeah, why not? Let's demand Slovenia. And I think if they refuse, I get a Cassis Bali or something against them. Hmm. Okay, so I'm at war with the Allies. Let's go ahead and invade here. United Kingdom is called in France. Okay, so France is on the Maginot. We should be able to hold. Let's invade Poland. We're going to go on speed three for a little while. We got war with France. Join wars. Italy wants to help in our war effort. I'm actually going to decline that for now. Let's finish up with Poland before we do anything else. All the Allies will be called in against us. Not a big surprise. We have motorized on the way. Let's get more tanks. Let's get some in Brandenburg. So what we're going to do is we're going to defeat Poland and then we're going to swing back around. Poland join the allies. Not a big surprise. And then we'll swing back around, come through the Maginot, right? And take out, take out France. So let's see how, how fast Poland will capitulate. So far, the invasion is progressing nicely. We have about 70 divisions, about 1 million men here invading. Um, let's see here. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's right, huh? I actually, uh, a friend of mine in the Twitch chat, just let me know. We're going to demand Slovenia and Yugoslavia. We're actually guaranteeing their, uh, or we're boosting their popularity. So it's not useful, is it? <laughs> so let's go ahead and get rid of that. Romania, though, I will leave that for now. Let's see. We're going to be friends. We're going to demand Slovenia. Denmark, how you doing, man? You're doing good? Okay. How's the naval combat here? Enemy has air superiority in Western Germany. Check that out. Benelux region is also under threat. Let's get some fighters. We actually have a significant need for fighters, which is interesting. A lot of enemy enemy troops are here. Uh, let's see. Enemy fighters in Western Germany. Hmm. Interesting. We have a lot of fighters here. Tactical bombers invading Poland. We should be okay. Uh, Poland has lost 40,000. We've lost 3,000. Everything looks good. We can demand that our allies join in just a little bit. It's not necessary right now. Unread naval battle results. We won. What happened over here? It looks like the enemy lost seven destroyers, one heavy cruiser, three light cruisers. Very nice. Okay. All right. So our Navy's pretty powerful. Uh, let's see. That's that's nice to know. I like I like a powerful Navy. There's nothing wrong with that. How's um the convoy rating going? I think it'll be fine. Okay. So we're about to invade all of Danzig. Send volunteers in Venezuela? I don't think so. Invasion's going well. Let's advance the offensive line to the Soviet border. Let's go ahead and do something like that. I have two army groups here. So let's advance the borders. And red naval battle results. Unread convoy results. Okay, we're reading some convoys. Very good. Very good. I like it. I like it. All right. Looks like the war is going good over here. Let's go ahead and get rid of Poland, and then we'll swing around. It's full-on assault Danzig, so we can get these troops out of here. Unread port strike results. Ooh, looks like we had a victory there. What's up here? Battle of Malika. Let's check out the Asian theater. Um... Hmm. 
So here in our Asian domain, things are good. I want to get rid of some of these troops over here. I kind of want to like come down here. We need to take um, North Borneo. That would be a good idea. Let's try and swing around and see if we can cut some of these dudes off. It looks like these troops are, are pretty crappy, so that'll be nice. Maintenance Company 2 is done. Unread port strike results. Very good, very good. Maintenance Company 2s. Do we need anything else? It's 1939. We can go for 1940 computing machine. That's not a bad idea. I do like more doctrine. Let's go ahead and go for some doctrine. We'll just keep that up if we can. Uh, unread port strike results. Very good, very good. We need 967 motorized, medium tanks, 1.8,000 fighters. We need a lot of fighters now. We, we will have to ramp up that fighter production uh, fairly soon. Are we producing more military factories or not? We're actually producing synthetics right now. So let's, let's remedy that. I do need a modest amount of military factories still on the way. Let's actually bump up what synthetics have progress. And then we'll, we'll work on some repairs and such. It's not a huge deal at the moment. Um, I need to get more troops over here. Let's actually go ahead and divert. Yeah, let's get let's give Gunther von Kluge the rest of those troops. Let's just do something like that. These men are going to finish up in Danzig. We should clear that out. Four or five divisions there. Plus the Navy. Alright, Cluj should finish up over there. We have good troops on the Maginot. The French will not attack. No way. No way in hell. They're not stupid enough to do it. Well, maybe they are. Getting some troops around here. Looks like here in the Romanian pocket. Or like in the Hungarian Romanian pocket. Uh, we have a significant number of troops stuck over here in Danzig. We do need to clear that out. Naval invasion, northwest Germany. Enemy is air superiority. Looks like all across this area. A lot of bombers here. Something to think about. Hmm. How are these fighters doing? Not doing too bad. Large ships at low strength. Okay. Okay. Uh, we had a port strike here. That's not good. Not good news. We got some improved radar. 1940. Hmm. Let's go for that improved computing machine. And I want to take a look at the air situation. We've cleared up the air situation here so the fleet can at least repair in peace. Uh, come on, Danzig, fall. Get the hell out of here, Danzig. Yeah, 1.14 million people live there. Foreign claims. Yep, it's a claim. All right, we just cleared Danzig. And we're going to keep advancing. Uh, we're going to be ready for this plan. Let's go ahead and launch that plan. An inferior enemy. I admit, I, I would probably guess so. Demand Slovenia. Let's see. What else can we do here? So we can do Armor Genius. Yep, I actually like that. We'll go ahead and get some armor going. His battles aren't going so well. Um, Poland has a surprising number of divisions, I will admit. Kind of a lot. So we're going to demand Slovenia. Depending on how Yugoslavia. Ooh, looks like, ooh, oh my god, we lost 41 subs right here? Holy shit, what happened there? Damn. And the enemy lost one destroyer and one cruiser. That was a French fleet right there. Holy shit. Okay. Let's actually go up to speed four. Let me go ahead and turn off the day and night cycle so you guys don't have a seizure. We got some improved oil plants. 1940 fighters would be nice. Let's actually go for the improved artillery, though. We can also improve our inventory equipment soon. Let's make sure I'm on here. 
Toad artillery, improved artillery. Let's move to improved artillery. We need a lot of fighters. The close air support is not bad, actually. Let's get another close air support over France. We actually don't have any fighters. Oh, they don't have the range. Okay, let's move it. Let's move it like that then. Um, fall of Poland has just happened. We have close air support in the Rhineland. Okay. Free military factories. I need a lot of artillery, a lot of fighters. Inventory equipment's not bad either. Let's actually go ahead and open up another artillery line. <laughs> Let's go down here. I wish you could drag and drop, seriously. Okay, so we've, um... Yeah. Poland's done. Right, so let's move... To the Belgian border. Let's do something like this. Right, and circle all those troops. Oh yeah, that's right, we need to invade Belgium first. All right. Okay, so let's just get all those troops. Let's get them over. Unread port strike results. Okay. Looks like they're trying to bomb my, my ports or something. It's not a huge deal. Um, we could use some better, better fighters over here, though. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, let's see. I got a comment in the Twitch chat. Fighters need rubber. Well, uh, if you don't see here, actually, the Netherlands is my puppet. And if I come over here to Asia, all of this belongs to me. Ooh, check this out. All of this belongs to me. We have the rubber that we need, actually. We don't, we don't have a need for rubber. We've, we actually attacked the Netherlands very, very early, and we took all of this. Let's see, can I can I attack some of these dudes? Hmm. Let's actually go ahead and cancel these orders. Yeah, so we had we had attacked. We had attacked Asia and we had taken all of the rubber supplies from the Netherlands, so we don't have a need for rubber anymore. <laughs> now I just need to get the actual planes built, you know. The enemy has uh, some impressive air superiority over here. It's not it's not terrible, but we do have a need for fighters, I would say. Northern France. Hmm. Let's actually go ahead and speed five for a while. We can invade the Soviet Union eventually. We have some resistance to occupation over there. That is a shame, but that'll clear up after we um, conquer the continent, right? So let's get ready for a Belgian invasion. Looks like some people are trying to launch a naval invasion or something. How's the, uh, the fleet? Fleet's doing pretty good. We lost a lot of subs. That was a shame, but we'll be okay. We'll be alright. So I got 35 divisions. Okay. Western Germany's threatened. Northwest Germany's fine. Yeah, we have a need for fighters. That much is clear. Oh, wow. They're producing a lot. Hmm. So let's demand Slovenia. I wonder if they'll give it to me. It's not a huge deal if they do or they don't. I don't care, really. Uh, I guess Italy does have claims on it, though, which is interesting. Hmm. Unread naval convoy results. We're raiding some convoys. Let's be prepared for... Demand Slovenia. We can invite to faction Japan. Let's do it. National focus. It's either around the Maginot. Yeah, it's gonna be around the Maginot. We need to invade Belgium. Let's get let's get the French out of here. It's tenth of June, uh, tenth of January. We're gonna be a little early for the invasion, but that's fine. That's fine. The faster we get them out of here, the better. Son of a bitch. Fucking troops, man. Okay, we need to uh, change this up a little bit. Let's go for patrol. In these three regions. And then let's get the subs. We do need subs. They need to... 
They need to patrol. Uh, Mecklenburg is their, is their base. Okay, so let's send uh, these motorized up here. Let's get these motorized up here. Oh, son of a bitch. That's five fucking divisions right there. Are you kidding me? Hmm. That's right. Before I forget, let's withdraw these tactical bombers. Let's get some tactical bombers over here. That's a large air base. We're going to bomb. Yeah. Yeah, that'll be good. Uh, let's see. What's going on here? I got to take this back for sure. I don't want to. I don't want them bringing more troops over here. Let's get that. Available war goal against Yugoslavia. Oh, yeah. Huh. I finished that. Did Yugoslavia... I guess they might have declined, didn't they? Oh, well. Uh, I can't pull back troops to invade Yugoslavia. That's not going to happen. So in that case... Uh, let's see. I lost 30,000 men invading Poland. United Kingdom's lost 73,000. Poland lost a quarter of a million. Holy shit. Uh, what's going on here? I got a battle going on between these subs and some other people. Interesting. We won. We killed some destroyers. Very nice. Let's get these guys out of here. Holy shit, 13 divisions landed here. That's a lot. Nemo combat in the North Sea. We got some... Wow, that's like that's like the Royal Navy right there. Oh, yeah. We'll see how that goes. Around the Maginot is going to be done pretty soon. We got we to get these troops out of here. Huge naval battle over here. Okay. Interesting. How is the Asian theater? Uh, ooh, the Australians over here, huh? No significant resources there, so not a huge deal. We're clearing up what's left of the British here. This is what it looks like, I think. We just encircled these divisions. Okay, we just overran them. Okay, we've secured most of this. We got the round the Maginot. You know. Let's come over here. Are we ready to invade? Hmm, let's take a look at this for a second. Let's get the anti-Soviet pact. These guys are moving in here. They are attacking over a river, though. These guys are ready to go. Let's deploy these troops. Let's get them over here on the border. Hmm. Some naval battles going on. Okay. 13th of February. We got some time. Damn, 12 whole divisions of troops there. Holy shit, man. Okay, we're ready. Let's go ahead and declare. That's the air situation. It's actually pretty good. We've cleared out most of that. Let's declare here. Let's declare on Luxembourg. Let's go ahead and invade, and then we will give them additional orders to to invade all across. Whoa. 
all across there. Let's do it. These wars should merge. Yep, wars just merged. We're on speed four. We can let that go for a little while. I gotta clear out the rest of these troops here. Hmm. Production's going good. Medium tanks are clearing up. Everything's clearing up. We're doing okay. Uh, Italy's just fighting against Yugoslavia. Not a big, not a big surprise. What's up with these troops? Where are these troops over here? Who are these guys? Huh. Who are these? Interesting. I guess I have like spare divisions over here. Oh. Weird. Okay, we lost 41,000. The Dutch have lost a lot. I wonder why. How's everything going over here? Are we doing okay? I think so. They have a base here. The British, I think that's the British Raj. Belgium has capitulated. Let's come over here. Alrighty, so France has moved in troops over here. We will not attack across the Maginot. That's not what we're going to do. We have free military factories. Thank God. What do I need a lot of? Fighters. That's what it looks like. Let's get some fighter ones. Looks like we... Uh, oh, how's our constructions? That's right. Synthetics are coming along. Shipyards are coming along. We need some radar. And we actually need a lot of repairs, too. Hmm. But overall, things are looking okay. We're going to clear out these dudes. They're broken. They don't have any supply. They're done. Let's move the troops over here. These six motorized can join this invasion. And let's execute. Make sure we execute that plan. Significant numbers of French troops here. Holy shit. Significant numbers. Uh, oh yeah, those fighters, yeah, they can't move anywhere else. We got a lot of close air support. They have a lot of fighters garrisoning this area though, so that's gonna be a shame. Let's get an infantry expert. They've pulled a lot of troops back from the Maginot. We're attacking through Belgium. It looks like we're being kind of like stuck a little bit. Uh, I need fighters and close air support. Okay. I've lost 55,000 men. United Kingdom and France have lost some. It's 1940. There's some technology we could use. We're doing okay for now. Uh, any forts here? There are forts here, actually. Looks like they might have fortified this area. They expanded the Maginot. Hmm. Could be a problem. So if I can't force a breakthrough here, we're going to have some issues. I mean, for God's sakes, man, I have like 1.1 million men over here. That's some improved inventory equipment. Oh, yeah, these men can't even force a breakthrough, can they? Could be a problem. Could be a problem. Actually, uh, looks like we're, we might have a breakthrough. Still a lot of men along the Maginot. We've broken through. Looks like we've, we've breached the fortified line. There's some bunkers here. Yep. Looks like we're doing okay. It's not great, but it's not bad. Uh, Romania has yet to have... Fascist revolution. Hmm. What's the Soviet Union up to? Anti-fascist diplomacy. Ooh. Interesting. We've sent it, we have a significant breakthrough now. They're going to be pulling troops out all along this area. Uh, let's go ahead and attack across the Maginot. These guys say that they're ready. These guys are supporting an attack. These guys are ready to attack. These guys actually might require some more men. Okay, so we've got 100,000 casualties. The French have lost a lot, too. Oh, that's right. These guys don't have any plans to invade, do they? Hmm. Yeah, I just forgot that I didn't assign them a battle plan. 
Alrighty, so yeah, it looks like we've done the um, the around the Maginot. We're gonna cut off significant numbers of French troops and I think British troops somewhere in there. Um, yes, it looks good. Northern France does have enemy air superiority, but we're doing okay. We got an ace pilot that was promoted. Are we gonna break through the Maginot? Maybe, almost. We've pushed up significantly across these these areas here. We're about to cut off troops in Calais. The Battle of Calais has been taken. Um, the fall of Paris. We just took Paris. I think they're going to capitulate pretty soon. France. Yeah, they're going to be screwed. Once we take Le Havre and probably... Um, yep, 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 yep. They're screwed. Strasbourg, Nancy. Strasbourg, Alsace, Lothringen. Alrighty, we're doing very well. We're doing very well. France will fall. France will fall if I have anything to say about it. Let's get them some secondary objectives. Let's go ahead and execute this plan. Let's actually halt that assault right there. So, do we need more men? Do we need to be training some divisions? I don't think so. I think we're okay for now. There was a defeat here in the Battle of the Eastern North Sea. We lost one submarine. Looks like we have some other battles going on. Okay, how many fighters does the British have? 4,000 to 7,000. Okay. Triumph in France. We're going to establish Vichy France. We will do that. Second Armistice at Compiègne. Okay, let's clear out what's left of the French. We have some military factories. Let's get some more... Hmm. If not light tanks, maybe motorized? Let's get another motorized line, I think. I like how that sounds. Let's come up here. Okay, so let's clear out what's left of the French. We'll occupy some of this territory. The flight of Rudolf Hess, Francis, capitulated. Vichy France will do what it needs to do. Okay, that's it. It's done. So let's put these troops here. Uh, for a little while, I want them on occupation duty. I want them to occupy a lot of this. And let's get these troops. You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna get, we're gonna put them over here, on the border with the Soviet Union. Defend Romania. Italy did not declare on Yugoslavia. That's weird. We got the anti-Soviet pact. German Reich formalizes a anti-Soviet pact. Has long condemned communism in all forms and has made diplomatic motions to demand other nations, and demand to demand other nations oppose it as well. There's only one way to counter the communist threat. Hmm. Army Innovations, War with the USSR, or the Second Vienna Award. Or Befriend Sweden. Let's go for the Second Vienna Award. Maybe I can bring Romania into the fold. We got some free military factories? Really? How many more fighters? We have a lack of oil and a lack of tungsten. It's not bad, though. It could be worse. Let's go ahead and bring up some of these repairs first. Let's get some of these uh, buildings repaired. We can switch to war economy eventually. Time to train up some more troops. We need panzers, so let's do one line. Let's train up motorized. We need one line. No, actually we'll do, yeah, we'll do unlimited for the motorized, that's fine. How's the naval game going? It's going. Yeah, it's going. We got 26 dockyards. These guys are good to go. The inventory are also good. The motorized should be all good. We actually do have some room for another motorized inventory here. Pretty good defense, actually. Let's go ahead and make that combat with a 20. Okay, so we, we've conquered France a lot earlier than before, you know? So, and we even have an available war goal against Yugoslavia. That's right, I could invade Yugoslavia real fast. That's not a bad idea. Hmm. 
I guess. Sure. Refriend Yugoslavia. Demand Slovenia. Huh. Okay, I think I'm going to go ahead and take a quick break here, though, guys. So far, we're making some good progress. Um, I'm going to go ahead and take a break here, and we'll try and battle the Soviet Union and the, and the British in the next episode. Um, I'll be right back. Thank you so much.